Hey guys, and welcome back to another video on mother and daughter's cooking. Today, we are going to be making a popular request called pancit. Don't forget to like and share this recipe with family and friends. Then going straight forward into this video, we are going to be using two packets of these noodles shown right here and soaking them in water for 15 to 30 minutes. And here we have some chopped garlic, onions, carrots, celery, green beans, and green bell peppers. For this, you can use any type of meat. We are specifically using today some fresh shrimp and frozen shrimp. And here we are peeling them and saving the heads. And this is a very important step to not skip. Then with the shrimp we just peeled, we're just adding that to the other shrimp. Now we are just gently crushing the shrimp heads. And as you can see, this is what is going to add flavor to your pancit. In addition to this, we add about 1 fourth to 1 half cup of water. Moving on, we're going to be adding our extra virgin olive oil and frying our garlic first. And since our pan is very wide, we're just going to be adding our onions to the side. Then we mix this together and we're adding our shrimp. And make sure this is not golden brown when you add it. Let the shrimp cook halfway and then we're going to add our vegetables starting with some green beans and mixing that all together. Now adding our carrots and mixing that all in together. Then we're going to add our celery as well. And last but not least, our green bell peppers. Now moving on, we have one cup of chicken broth. Then we added a tablespoon each of beef bouillon and chicken bouillon. Then little by little, we're slowly adding this chicken broth to our vegetables. As well as that, we are also draining the water from our noodles. Next, we are adding about one and a half cups of soy sauce and mixing that in with our vegetables. And we also add in an extra four cups of chicken broth. Now we are adding our shrimp broth slowly into our vegetables. And finally, we are mixing our noodles with our vegetables. Then we mix this evenly and cooked this for 30 to 40 minutes until well cooked. And as you can see, this is what it should look like when it's almost finished. And this is what it should look like when fully cooked. Finally, here's our final product. This is an easy and simple recipe of how to cook pancit. Thank you for watching this video on mother and daughter cooking. And we'll see you next time in our next video.